The time is long overdue. Welcome to Service Level, Megano. Now enjoy these epic disasters, if you will. I'm afraid I've got some bad news. Did you know that games are a waste of time and money? And the sad part is you've been falling for it for decades. And ironically enough, so am I. So it kind of figures itself out now, doesn't it? And here to explain is my counterpart, Kevin Anderson. Take it away, Kevin. Thank you, Scully. All right. Games are a waste of time and money. You know why? Because you've been falling for it for fucking decades because you don't think you have anything else better to do with your life when everything else better to do with your life has been standing in front of you the whole fucking time. Let me tell you people something. Candy Crush, all those slot games, the casino, GameStop, Call of Duty... And, and I know I don't want to say this, but I'm going to say it anyway. Sonic the Hedgehog. You know, all those games. Pretty much every game, from a general standpoint, is a waste of time and money! Do you understand? It's a waste of time and money. And as this guy named Dottie Janky always says, Energy is preserved when you don't waste your time or money. And I believe he was from India, if I recall correctly, but what the hell would I know, because I don't know everything, because I'm not God. God's up there, he lives through me, and I have to live through him, and that's that. So, technically, what does that make all of us? Just as much a part of him as I am. Or anybody else, for that matter. And, and you know what's funny? You know what's funny? The funny thing is, you people fall for this shit every single day because you continue to buy $300, $400 games for your PS4s and your Xbox and your Xbox One X's, and you play these games knowing that they're going to suck, but you pray to God that they don't suck. And when they do suck, they suck a hell of a lot more than you could ever imagine. And then you want to bring your stupid games back for a refund, knowing all too well that once you open a game, you can't bring it back. How about that shit, huh? I'll tell you this. I'll tell you this. And it's like I said before. Games are a waste of time and money. They're a waste of life. They're a waste of space. And they're a waste of energy. Because there is no fucking point. There's no point in having to spend $300 on a game that never ends. A game that you know is going to suck. And you hope that that game doesn't suck. And it sucks. So to all you cucks out there who don't give any fucks about what I'm saying. Know that what I'm saying is the truth, because it has been proven to me through God himself. God has shown me these things. He knows these things to be the truth, because the truth is through him. Not through some reptilian, monkey-faced, dipshit politician, or Democrat, or Socialist, or a fucking Antifa supporter, or a terrorism supporter of any kind. And, and, you know, it's so funny, because all those games that they shit on, they deserve a lot less hate than they care to let on. But that's beside the point, isn't it? Because games, as I've said, is a waste of time, and it's a waste of money, and it's a waste of life, because you don't get anything about playing games. You get everybody and their family pets want to make a career on YouTube, wasting their lives and their time and their money, playing games and streaming them on their computers and uploading them to YouTube, hoping they'll get even 10 views. Many of the videos that I do online, I don't even get 10 views! And those that do, 
Don't even get past 50! It's hilarious! <laughs> Guys, you have, you have no clue, man. You have no clue. And let me tell you something. As long as I'm a man, know that whatever game you buy that you know is going to suck, don't hope for that game to be good, because it's not going to be. It's going to be a waste of time. And 99 out of every 100 games are like this, so don't deny it, because you know it's true. Right? Right. What the fuck? You want to see you, my friend, Cringe Call. He's got some really cringe shit here, don't he? Yeah. Style. High school style. High school style. Yeah, that's where you want to be. Here we have something called the Spartan Web based on courtesy. If you try your best and do your best, you will oh, succeed. God. Clubs, beat them, chess band, and sports. Yeah. Now the Spartan, a football team can beat Pepway or Hempfield any day. Cheers for oh, 10. I'll style you in any way. If you do what's right, people. Hello, this is Dog. I don't think dogs say hello, they go bark. It's a meme, you dip. <laughs> okay. Oh, so it's a meme. Everything! It's such a meme. Oh, do you not know the popular culture of the internet? Yes, I actually do. But then never... you know the hello, yes, this is dog meme. Oh, no. See, Whoa. if that kid were on the street, he would have gotten his teeth shoved down Some his people are not addicted to it. <laughs> if you knew true internet culture, you would know the battle. Right. You think you're all bad, but you're not. Oh my god, this this is not this is <laughs> not going to end well at all. Oh man, adjectives. This isn't gonna end well. Oh no shit tails, Mike. <laughs> I think you can rap, but you choke. You're a freaking joke. You're gay, you can't get a girl anyway. You, you make people Ooh, like me look yep. like shit! Open, so there's different like uh techniques to do it. Like it's really hard to explain. But yeah, YY -Y is just like when you jump off, you can click YY -Y on your controller. You can bend it over. You can use the one on the screen as well, right? Then you get a can swap, which is like when your gun like clicks or just like an animation. Like, I don't know, it's, it's an animation. It's like funny. you're being malnourished. A knack, which is uh. You have to click X, Y, no. But what is it oddball such as myself consider manly? My little pony, friendship is magic. Now I know what some of you are thinking. You watch a show for little girls? Well, well, contrary to what you may think, oh, there are more male teen to adult fans than there are young girl no. fans. That's how much no. of a phenomenon it has become. There are, there are tons of internet jokes and hundreds of thousands of fans known as bronies. In case you can't tell, I'm one of them. Now, uh, I will be explaining the development <laughs> of the plot. A male student emailed the principal recently asking if he could wear what? a dress to the prom. The school superintendent tonight tells Eyewitness News that a meeting was held. Are you fucking a kidding me? And a faculty. Senior Cameron Engel thought it would be a goof to go to the Morgan Senior Prom next month in a long sleeve pink prom gown in the style of the character Pinky in the My Little Pony cartoon. But school administrators had to ask Cameron one question. Why? When they asked me, it was more of a just, yeah, I was doing it for the fun of it. I don't give a shit if you were doing it for the fun of it. That is great. Yes. Thanks to my friend Diesel Patches for coming up with this latest shit, huh? All right, let's check that out. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. This is going to be so much cringe. Ah, I know. I use my newest jutsu. Cue the Benny Hill theme song! Well, that was something. Why did I stop helping Ben Hill theme song from the Oh, because of this. But the thing is, there's so many students, and how am I supposed to find them unnoticed? Benny Hill is laughing in his grave right now. Ah, I'll do what Zetsu does. Go around the bee and not noticed. He is a spy after all, the Akatsuki. What the fuck? Oh boy. Time to get sneaky. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
just definitely <laughs> pant. I hear they're supposed to be what doing the vampire fuck night is cosplay. <laughs> I think one of them is supposed to be dressed up as Zero. And I want you to give some space to our guest, Shalon. Do not judge her until you know her whole story. She has been searching for three and a half years for the father of her daughter, Kayla. And we have already heard from 16 men. One of those guys was... In the case of four-year-old Kayla, Rashad... You are not. Come to three-year-old Zaria. You are not. Not the father. Leonard, you are the father. You are not. Idiots. Obviously, 
put yeah, something around her clear. neck. Yeah, I see this And very you clear. don't feel the and need mark- to go to the hospital and ask your little girl who did this to you? Yeah. I'm not a monster. Oh, what would you call somebody not. that has sex with children? I did that not. abuses children? I did not. I'd call him a monster. I did not. You did. did. You don't say I don't know. You don't say I didn't do it. Who broke your baby's leg? I fell on her. I was walking to my house and I accidentally tripped over a jack I had in the house that wasn't supposed to be in there and I fell on her on accident. You didn't fall on her. You didn't trip over some jack. Don't you never touch me again. again. Push me. You're going to go after a woman? I didn't I'm going to allow rapists to go after a woman? Appointments because there is a way. Damn it, you make an appointment the next day and you bring her back no, the next day. Oh, you get that all up my kid. stage. That's what you, you kiss him. Get there. You get out. Get going. You got There's it. the door right there. The choices that I make. It's not your but life at the anymore. Same time, I keep. You are supposed to protect her. Damn it. Yeah. Whatever. She's lying. Whatever. Can you say lying. something? Your ass is a. Your ass is a. Would really killing people that never did a damn thing to you. You think it's okay? I can have any man. I'm going to tell you something right now. If somebody, if my daughter came to me and right. said she was molested, I'm not waiting for right. appointments. I'm not waiting to see some right. damn doctor. I will kick in the damn door and make them examine right. Come on, man. Well, come on, man. What? I find it amazing it's that you wouldn't even think of this. Man. Shut up. I I'll tell you something that. right now. It might hurt you as a father, but I'll tell you right now. Tell me. My son's still alive. Well, my God. You know that you know that I'll tell you. I can't with that every night. Uh-huh. You're a I can't go with my son. 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 I can I don't know what answer to give you, okay? Why you did it? That's a simple damn answer. Why you did it? I didn't twist it. You want to laugh? You want to laugh at my expense? Abuse me, Phil. Abuse me. I'll tell you what. I could not live with myself. I, I, I could not live with I myself. I love myself. If I ever... How are you not a junkie? I'm not a... How are you trying to help your daughter? You told the police that you twisted her leg yeah, because, because I she was get crying. Over with. I want the... I mean, you, you get the general idea, right? You get the general consensus. Do you not? Do you not? Do you not? I mean, I mean... No, 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 no. Tabloid talk shows are a waste of time. They are a waste of time. But yet, tens of millions of people all over the world want to watch them because they're entertaining. Bull crap. They're a waste of time. And that's time you'll never get back. Ever. Not even in hell. On the wings of love. No, I don't even care. I don't even care. Seriously, I don't care. I mean, that's, that's all talk shows in general. They just... I mean, you know what I'm saying? That's all talk shows in general. They just spew random bull crap out of their ass and just expect you to buy into it. Silence! Not sure what difference this is going to make, but okay. It's me, Mario! Oh my god! And to all you people who think tabloid talk shows are a real benefit to the TV community, you need to shut the f- I mean, you, you need to watch your ass. Narrow for another round from yours truly, our friend, Rich Wilson. Hey, I wonder what that thing is. Uh, let's check it out. Oh my god! Oh! Okay, huh. Whoa! Whoa, 
What would happen if England were not in the EU? Well, of course, something like that would happen, but oh my god, that's just... I can't even... I honestly, legit don't understand that. It's just crazy. Jesus Christ, I mean... <laughs> yeah, you can say that again. Shut up, I'm not in this freaking thing to have you in there. Okay. Well, anyway, I just, I don't know how to respond to this. This is, I, I don't, this is next level cringe. It's like the EU wants to freaking bow down to Muhammad or Allah or, or Satan or whatever the hell. Oh my God, I just don't, I'm done, man. I'm just, oh my God. Ugh. Ugh. I can't, uh, this just, uh, what in the world? Ah! I can't even just explain that, this is crazy. This just, you can't, it, it's just, what just even happened? I don't know, man, what do you think? I don't know, I don't know either. Oh my god. Ah, this, this. I can't even, this, the cringe level on this is just fucking nuts! You can't explain that, can you? I mean, you can't. There is no way to explain that, because it doesn't need any explaining, though, does it? Of course it doesn't. I don't care what they said, just switch places! I mean, you know, golly, you get cussed! Because you can't, it's this next level crunch. Ah, Lord! There's a next level crunch right here. But anyway, I digress. Because you think with all the stuff that goes on on a daily basis, because it's just... I can't even explain that. You can't... Because... Uh, how the... Uh, I mean, how do you even explain that? It's still- Oh! Oh, God! <laughs> oh! I can't- Oh! Who would it- Who raised this woman? This- This, this is crazy! <laughs> Looks like she just busted a net or something. Oh my god! Uh, I just, I, I can't even explain this, man. Cause, cause, but it's, oh, ah! Oh, I'm telling you, man. I'm just, I am so, I am so unbelievable. Quick reminder: this episode of Savage Level Mega Noel is sponsored by Michael Motes and Georgia Peach. Also known as at Freedom Motes and at Real Peachy Keen, respectively, who remind you every day that Peter Strzok is full of shit. It's also been brought to you by the Corporation for Public Broadcasting, which is paid for by suckers like you. Do us all a favor. If you don't like what you see, turn the freaking channel. Bye bye.